Why did you decide to present your artworks at the Spark Art Fair? Well, I was mainly uh, my gallerist uh, who, who asked me if I wanted to participate. She has been invited here. Um, and of course, it's a great opportunity. Uh, so yeah, I'm really pleased. How do you create the motives in your work? Well, everything actually starts with uh, me going out to, to nature areas, uh, going out on, on hikes and to be able to see and to feel uh, certain areas. Um, and then I document it uh, with my camera. Um, and then I go back in the studio at the atelier uh, and put all these images into Photoshop. Well, then we'll edit and it'll become a, a sketch for the, for the work. Could you tell us uh, the story behind this picture? Yes, uh, this picture is called uh, Along the Horizon. And it started uh, a morning where I woke up and it was really misty outside. So I grabbed my backpack and the camera and went out uh, and took a, a series of works. Um, and then when I was planning to, to do the whole uh, sketch on the computer, um, I read the newspaper as well. And it talked about how digital development and new technologies were coming in and becoming a part of how we also could save the climate. Um, so I think that article affected me in, in how the, the grid turned out in, in especially this painting. Okay. Is there an, an idea behind the grid structure? Yeah, that's, that's the thing. Um, well, especially for this one, it becomes very constructed. Uh, because I had this digitalization uh, in my mind. But in general, it's much more about that when we see a landscape, it's a constructed space. Even the, um, the landscapes, the foresters, we have, we have decided that this area should be like that. Um, there's no real natural forests anywhere. And if there are small spots, it's because we have decided within latest years that it should be like that. Um, so we are rewilding nature again somewhere and I think that's an interesting thought. Also, how do we feel nature? Uh, the production foresters, we sometimes feel them as real natures as well. Uh, and is that an illusion? No, the feeling is true. But the forest has a different purpose. Um, so how do we find the balance between feelings, construction, or, or uh, constructed forests, uh, rewilding programs and stuff like that. I think these questions are, are really interesting for me. Um, also in biodiversity and climate changes uh, and stuff like that. So it becomes a part of it, yeah. So you have a very special relation to nature. I do, I do. Ever since I was a child I've been hiking, walking, sailing, uh, going out trying to see and feel it, yeah. Um, and I really truly believe that nature is something that we need to find the value in again uh, because it has such a big meaning for us. Uh